Today we are going to learn about exponents and their purpose. First, let's look at the parts of an exponential expression. If you look at the example here, you can use the acronym BEN for an exponential expression. We start with the base in this expression. The base is 3. There is a small number which we call an exponent that looks like it is above the base, which tells us how many times we need to multiply the base. Our second step then is here. This is the exponential expression in what we call expanded form. Here we are writing out that we are multiplying 3 by itself 1, 2, 3, 4 times. When we multiply 3 times 3 times 3 times 3, we get 81. You can think of this as the number in the acronym BEN. It is also our product. Now let's look at the different ways we can write exponents. If you look at this example, we are multiplying 2 by itself multiple times. On the left side, you will see that we have the examples written in expanded form, such as 2 times 2, or 2 times 2 times 2. When we write it in exponential form, we write the 2 as the base, since that is the number we are multiplying. Then we write the number of times we are multiplying the 2 at the top in the exponent spot. At the right, then, in purple, you see that we have the solution, which you can also refer to as the product since we are multiplying with exponents. You can also think of this as the value of the exponential expression. You can see that exponential form has a great purpose. Rather than having to write out 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, we can just write 2 to the seventh power. Looking at another example, 4 times 4 times 4, you can see that you are going to have the same solution, product, or value when you write it both ways. You can say 4 times 4 times 4 is 64, or 4 to the third power is 64. When your exponent is 3, you can also say cubed. So in this example, it would be 4 cubed. Now you try it. Here is a scenario. Pause the video to read and write the numerical expression. You can also find the product of this exponential expression. Good luck!